Hey guys, welcome back to my channel or welcome if you are new. Hi, my name is Jocelyn and welcome to today's video. This is going to be my Thanksgiving get ready with me. I'm filming this a few days before Thanksgiving so today isn't Thanksgiving day, you know what I mean? But I did want to get this up for you guys in time for Thanksgiving. Why not do a trial run to see what I'm going to be wearing and rocking for Thanksgiving. So I do show you guys how I got this makeup look as well as my hair and two different outfits that I would wear for Thanksgiving. This is one of them, um, of course, but you guys will see it more in depth at the end of the video as well as the second outfit that I show you guys. So go ahead and grab your makeup brushes, your turkeys and your blunts and let's go get glam. All right, y'all, let's go ahead and get fucking started. I'm gonna be using the Jaclyn Hill Divine Neutrals Palette. I have been using this like crazy since I got it earlier, beginning of October, end of September. And I mentioned when I first got it that this would be the perfect palette for Thanksgiving. And I still stand by that, so that's what I'm gonna be using. I'm gonna mix this color and this color and put this in my outer corner and halfway into my lid. I'm gonna use a little bit of this shade and this one and just blend out those edges. And then I'm gonna go in one more time and just redefine those colors. I'm gonna take a combination of this shade, this one, and this one, okay? So all three of those, and I'm gonna wet it. And I'm gonna put this all over my fucking lid, okay? So literally from this beginning, to all the way out here, just all over my lid. Right in the center of that, I'm gonna take some of this shade here because y'all know olive green has been like the ish this year, okay? So I'm gonna take just a little bit of that and wet it as well. Put this right in the center of all of that. Just for a little dimension, a little pop of color. Ooh, pretty, pretty. Yeah, you guys, I'm featuring this olive color throughout this look. So. I'm gonna take the Stila Stay All Day Liquid Liner in the shade Intense Jade. Oh, bitch, I cannot see that better. I'm pretty sure it's intense jade, okay? It's just this olive green color. Like I said, this is the featured color in today's look. Y'all, I think I could survive on just coffee and weed for the rest of my life. Line my upper lash line. If you can do a wing liner, that would look epic with this color, but um, I'm not gonna try because I know I can't and I'm not fucking up this eye look. It looks really pretty. And then right on top of that, I'm gonna take a little, little bit of this shade right here. Just the smallest little bit because I don't want it to hide the green, but I do kind of want to smudge it and set it. So that's what I'm doing. I'm gonna take this primer serum by Wet n Wild to prime my face. I never really show you guys what I do for my face makeup, so I think I'm gonna include this in here. Plus, I just wanna chat with y'all. <laughs> and of course, using the e.l.f. Putty Primer on the center of my face. It's a few days before Thanksgiving. Um, this is my like little trial to see if this is the makeup that I'm gonna wear. <laughs> um, because I wanted to get this video up for you guys for Thanksgiving. So that's why I'm doing it earlier and not on like the actual day. I'm gonna go get my nails done later today as well. So I won't have my sparkly birthday nails anymore. I don't know. I don't know what I want. I was kind of thinking like something like red. I don't know. I've never had red nails. I always just stick to like neutral colors for my nails <laughs> as I have glittery purple <laughs> nails on right now. Do you guys get like ready ready for Thanksgiving? Or is it more of a casual thing for y'all? Because 
I've had Thanksgivings where, you know, it's like super cash, like PJs type of thing. But I've also had Thanksgivings where it's like, we're not leaving the living room, but we're all like done up and cute. I always like to do my makeup though, because no matter what, like I at least want to look fabulous. Y'all know what I mean? I think we're doing more casual this year. Not PJs, but also not like going out buchones. <laughs> yeah, know what I mean? So I'm gonna take the Born This Way foundation by Too Faced and put this around my face. And I'm gonna take this hourglass stick foundation and put it in the center of my face. I've gotten very used to using like two different foundations instead of like one for like my whole face. <laughs> You don't have to do that, I just, I'm annoying. <laughs> so I kind of use that Hourglass foundation as almost like concealer. Um, well, I basically put it where I would put my concealer. Just because it's lighter than, you know, what I need it to be. Okay, so I'm gonna take my Benefit Hoola contour stick and a brush, and I'm gonna put some on the brush and then go in from there. So anywhere where I put that concealer is where this fit me is going. I'm gonna use my Too Faced Ethereal setting powder because um, I'm sure we're gonna be taking lots of pictures and I do not need no flashback, okay? So while my lashes dry, I'm gonna do my bronzer with my Chocolate Soleil by Too Faced. Okay, for blush, I'm obviously gonna take my Hourglass blush that I absolutely adore and I just think this color will go marvelous with the makeup that I have going on and I was right. Damn. I'm going to take this shade right here and smudge it on my lower lash line and then I'm going to take this shade, the one that I used right in the center, and I think I'm going to put that in my waterline. And for the highlight on my face, I'm going to take my Jeffree Star setting powder. Oh my god, look at that. I don't know if my camera picks it up the way it like goes on in person, but it's beautiful. Beautiful. Okay guys, so I'm moving on to my hair. I've got to finish my lips and eyelashes, but that's gonna wait until after I'm done. So I braided my hair before I went to bed and that's how I got this like wavy type of look. I'm gonna go in with my curling wand and just curl random ass pieces throughout my head. Um, but I think I'm only gonna do it like towards the bottom. Just like slightly. Okay, so we got like the top, a little wavy, and then you get towards the bottom and it's just like a little curled. Not too much, okay? And I'm just gonna kind of put my fingers through it a little bit, separate them. Yeah, the vibes. Okay, and I'm gonna do the exact same thing to the side. I'm done doing the whole curling thing. I'm gonna spray some dry shampoo in my hair, like into my roots, to give some volume. <laughs> and now just some frizz cream. Y'all know I don't know how to do hair, okay? I barely know how to do my makeup, so. <laughs> really quickly before I go change, I just wanna share with you guys what I put on my lips. So you guys know I always put Vaseline on them and then just line them with bronzer. Fill them in with the bronzer, and then in the middle, I put this liquid lipstick by Too Faced in the shade Child Star. It's like a pretty pale 
nude. So I just put that in the center. Let's go get dressed. Let's put some jewelry on, some cute perfume, and finish off the video. Okay, so I'm gonna be showing you guys two different outfits that I would wear for Thanksgiving, you know what I mean? So I just wanna say real quick that my casual is different from everybody's casual, okay? My casual is not really that casual, but it's casual to me, okay? So this is my casual <laughs> outfit. So my top, you guys, is from Fashion Nova. It is so fucking cute. I love this. Scrunches right here in the middle. It has this really pretty, like, detailing all along the tops and the bottom. So I decided to not do any necklaces or anything and just let the shirt kind of speak for itself, if you guys know what I mean. Um, it is cropped, as you guys can see. And then for my jeans, I'm just wearing these black ripped jeans from Hollister. They're skinny jegging. They're very, very cute. Um, for my boots, these are what my boots look like. Just a cute little booty. And actually, these actually have this like little detailing on them. I don't know if you guys can tell, but um, yeah, they have this like really pretty detailing and I just kind of thought this kind of matched the top a little bit. So that's why I chose these boots. I have on this chain belt. I absolutely love this belt. It is so fucking cute. Now this isn't really like a belt, like it's not gonna like keep your pants up, but it's more of a like, just an accessory, you guys know what I mean? My hoop earrings that I always wear. Don't I look ready to fuck some turkey up? I think so. <laughs> this is what I have on. So first off, um, we have this dress also for Fashion Nova, and it does have that little, like, ruching down the center, um, and it has these, like, little strings at the bottom. I was gonna wear this outfit with some thigh highs, but I just thought, like, the thigh highs and, like, these strings would, like, a little too much, so I just paired them with the same booties that I had on from earlier. For the jacket, I just have on this, like, I don't know, like moss green almost. You guys know green is the featured color of today's look, <laughs> of today's makeup look. So I just thought I could tie it in with the outfit. You can cinch it at the waist as you guys can see. And it does have a hood, which I, like I said, I like because it just gives you that like freedom of being able to like dress it down or dress it up. So I really, really fuck with this jacket. And for accessories, I just have my little mini bag here for earrings i have on the same hoop earrings as before um and for a necklace i actually put on this really cute one from pandora i hope you guys have a very 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 happy safe thanksgiving with all your loved ones your friends your family i just want to take this time you guys to say thank you to each and every one of you guys that have subscribed to my channel and that watch my videos and comment and stuff like that it Thank you, seriously, it just means the fucking world to me. Thank you guys so much for being here and for watching my videos and just fucking with your girl, you know what I mean? I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to subscribe down below before you guys leave and hit the little bell button so that you guys never miss out when I post a new video. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye guys.